following game is rated M for mature. Parents should be aware that this game contains violence, blood and gore, graphic language, and the use of drugs. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello fellow squeakers, and welcome back to another episode of Fallout 4. Well, as you can see, Buddy is slowly making his way through the city. This has been a very long, drawn-out, and boring escort quest. Not kidding, guys. This took, like, maybe about 10-15 minutes of nothing but inching along, just like this, occasionally shooting somebody. Who happened to get in the way and try to, uh, and try to make things tougher on us. It was... It was just ponderous. <laughs> I mean, seriously, it was awful. <laughs> so, we're finally here. And there's Buddy. Greetings, new friends. I am the Rufus. What the heck is this thing? You can it's that rolling machine I was telling you about. I am here to provide entertainment oh, and nice. That's awesome. <laughs> Fine, my just get it thing. set up over at the bar and out of my doorway. Commencing normal operations. You again. Staying with us today, I trust. Um. You know what? Uh, yes, yeah. I will rent a long hallway. Last room on the right. I will go ahead and rent a room. But here is even better than I was hoping for. Here's your money. 300 caps? All right. Well, thank you, Rufus. I appreciate hey, Rufus. that. How's it going? Uh, what do you have? Oh, that's right. This is just a... Uh... Not right now. Sure. See you around. I forgot. He's, a, uh, he's also a salesperson. Thanks again for pulling that job at Hallucigen. Those compounds are a little beyond me, but I'll figure it out. Anyway, you need some cameras? No, I'm I'm alright. Thanks. I'm always here if you need me. Uh, actually, you know what? Let me let Fred, me sell to you. you. I love you. If all my <laughs> customers were you, that would be super swell. Now I got all kinds of chems looking for a home. Tell you what. I'll take a look. Sure. Everything's been tested personally. Let me let me sell off my junk to you here. Um, cause I'm, I don't, I don't take these drugs. I, 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 I have decided this character will not do that. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and sell them to you since you are a, well, for lack of better word, pharmacist. <laughs> I don't really know any other way to put that. Um. Uh, and you know what? That that's that's good enough. All right, get out of this. All right, uh, so let's go ahead and go upstairs hey. and get some sleep and get ourselves that experience buff. She said, "Top floor, last room on the right, which is here." Yay. All right, um, and it's 12 o'clock, so let's just go ahead and sleep for eight hours. Hooray! Um, oh, shoot. Um, I have a real-life thing that I need to attend to real quick, guys. I will be right back. All right, I'm back. Uh, sorry about that little delay there. Let's look at what... You know, let, let's set up the M-I-L-A, Weather Vane, Backstreet Apparel. Uh, and let's see, what else do we... Oh, we also want to do this Boston After Dark and Mechanical Menace. We've had, like, both of these for some time. And, of course, we do eventually want to move that way. Um, all right, tell you what, yeah, let's just go... Let's, like, start moving our way this way and kind of just discover stuff this direction um it's the old corner bookstore so we're we're in 
Well, actually, no, we're, we're, we're in a place that we don't want to be right this moment, because this is not the old corner bookstore. Why does this think I'm in the old corner bookstore? <laughs> that doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I just clean up around here. Good for you. Go, buddy. Go and go and do that. <coughs> All right, so let's. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm not like Flemmy. Uh, I guess let's go to. Do we just want to do it from here? I'm not sure why it thinks. I mean, I'm a good neighbor. Why don't I go to Old Corner Bookstore and then I'll just set off to the northwest let's do that um we've kind of and we'll just travel that direction and see what we can discover on our way to to those two quests uh hopefully they will be fairly point blank we'll, we'll be able to just go there you know retrieve dead drops find caravans uh, you know, write those write those quests off of our our list here. Uh, all right, I'm currently facing the wrong direction. I want to go that direction. No, uh, that direction. Oh, okay, so those three right there. Uh, <coughs> oh, hey! Do you mind? Die. Uh, and do that. Eh? Where are you? Eh? Who else? <laughs> you! You! There! And have some of that, and a little bit of that, and a, and a whole lot of get the hell out of my face. Okay, let's have some ribs. How do you like your ribs? Why, well, I like my ribs burnt! Haymarket Mall. Oh! Ha! Oh! Okay, that's not what I wanted to do. Wait, wait. Okay, somebody told me... Oh, that's how you do it. Oh, but it's over there. Darn it. Uh, let's try this. Oh, darn it. Um, supposedly, you can uh, shoot grenades out of the air. And so, I mean, I guess the theory is... Whoa. I guess the theory is somewhat... Proved since we at least, um, since we, we were at least, uh, able to target it. Oh, oh, shoot. I am carrying too much. I need to offload this stuff. I keep forgetting to offload this stuff. Uh, okay, tell you what. I am going to eat, um, something heavy. Let's eat something heavy. Um, no, not that. Something heavy. We want, uh, let's, let's have some grilled, no, well, yeah, let's go ahead and eat another grilled rad stack. Uh, and then, let's just go, uh, and, and go drop some stuff off. I completely forgot about that. Uh, let's just run over here real quick. Eh, and go. We will, we will drop off our stuff, uh, cause I keep forgetting to do that. <coughs> and then, we will go, and we will make that trip, and we will discover things, win friends and influence people and all all that happy stuff. All right. Store all junk. And give that over there and give those over there. Uh all that's fine. Uh okay, so we are going to go over to here and give over that and that and that and that uh those things i i will cook these all later and 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 have this all put together properly done later for now we're just offloading hey you hey boy come here quit quit dog me quit moving <sighs> i tell you this dog I love him to death. I do. I love dog meat. He is the dog. But there are times. That dog meat chooses to be something of a hassle. Uh, Alright, let's just go in here. 
and let's store our junk and give over all this stuff right there there and there there and there those are our main all right and then one of those fatigues give over those and that and I'll figure out if I want to actually keep any of this stuff later for right now I'm just offloading uh, that'll do all right <clears throat> go back over to uh, I guess Haymarket We're probably going to, like, appear in the middle of a huge fight between gunners and super mutants and, like, super robots and God only knows what else. <laughs> a super sledge is a rocket-enhanced sledgehammer capable of dealing a tremendous amount of damage. A rocket-enhanced sledgehammer. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, oh, no, don't go looking for stuff, okay? We're, we're going this... We're going this way. Oh. No, yeah, we're going this way. We're heading towards these things. We're not exploring right now, okay? We'll get things on the way, but this is not the priority. We are going this direction and exploring this direction and looking around and seeing what we can see. Okay, uh, and kind of doing opportunity looting. Okay, that's what we're doing, dog meat. We're dog meat. <sighs> dog meat. All right, so there's something. Retrieve the dead drop. Okay, so this is the dead drop. There he is. Somehow I feel as if that was probably a scam, since everybody we look at in there is dead. I'm just saying. Just curious. All right. <clears throat> Look at you. All right, uh, torso, torso. Anybody else? Where did you come from and why were you there? Okay, so here's the dead drop. It's got that, that little starburst thing on it. Stockton's hollow tape. Meet Old Man Stockton. Meet Old Man Stockton. Okay, so we'll go this way. 94. Okay. We're keeping an eye out, and we're keeping an ear open. Just in case... Oh, no, that's... That's not a way through. Cotton yarn. Oh! Hi! Uh... Do we have... Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, torso. One, two... Three. Good. And... Good. That's weird looking. It's so dark in this game, I swear. Every time I do anything, it's nighttime. <laughs> oh, oh, shoot! Alright, you and you. Anybody else? No. Oh, that's a fair. That's a fair. Okay, that was an alpha. Uh, go ahead and grab both of those. Oh, is this a... Oh, it's a grill. I thought that was a... Uh, 
a workshop for a second. I was like, holy cow, what the heck? All right. Uh, not that way. Our way around. Hey, What's good today? Just got a lot of scrap metal in. Could fix you up with some new tack or new shoes for your Brahmin. Uh, I think the boss is trying to keep our costs light for the next run. Well, you better hope that over here. I, I was hearing something. There's some sort of conversation going on, but I can't get close enough to hear it. Bunker Hill? Oh, it's a settlement! There you are. Well, sort of a. I'm half tempted to join the railroad with all this shit. I don't know. People gotta do something, Dad. When did you start to care about sense? It's not that. The railroad hey, is the you. only one standing Talk up to the institute. Talk some sense into my numbskull son. Getting involved with the railroad is just trouble. Um. Well, I mean, you should help others. It's always good to help people. I have no problem helping people. Since, though? All I do here is help crusty old caravan <clears throat> hands, no offense, go blind off rot gut. At least the railroad's fighting the Institute. And why not save sense? Might as well go off and join the Death Claw Preservation Society. <laughs> uh... I still haven't decided. I mean, I'm, technically, I am. I I'm a part of the railroad, but I'm still like on the fence about this. So, how about just service? I'm getting some service here. Where are my manners? If you want a drink, talk to me. Need a bed? Well, hit up Numbskull over there. <laughs> hey, fine place to sleep right here. Reasonable rate. Uh, motel. This some kind of motel? I prefer the term flop house. <laughs> but don't tell my pa that. Gets him mad. When caravans pull into town, they need a place to sleep. So we ran out all the beds we can. So did you want one? Uh, how many caravans? How many caravans come through here? All of them. They kind of own the whole town, but money still has to change hands, so they know which caravan owes what. Huh. Bunker Hill is one big money makes the world go round kind of place. Really? Raider problem? Pay him off. Supply problem. Buy more. Charge more. Hey, weren't we talking about you renting a room? You need one? Bribes? So Bunker Hill just buys its way out of problems? It's all they know. Caravan folk are money folk. And all the people who settled here retired from the caravans. Hmm. Now that doesn't mean a Bunker Hill boy doesn't know how to sling a gun. But why waste the bullets if you can buy your way out of trouble for less? Hey. Sure. Yeah, okay. Uh, let's go ahead Fine. and rent the room. Here's your caps. Any vermin you find is yours. No extra charge. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, there's... That's that, but... Where... What's... Where's the room? Oh, okay, up here. Gotcha. Sleep. All right, so let's sleep until daylight, because I'm tired of doing things in the evening. I want to actually do something during the day. Oh, oh yeah, I feel rested. Okay, so there's our old man Stockton guy. Uh, how do I get to you? Like this. All right. Hello, old man hey Stockton. There. Welcome, my friend. Might I ask, do you have a Geiger counter? Uh, countersign. Mine is in the shop. You? I was expecting someone of the uh, feminine persuasion. You're with our mutual friend. Feminine yes? persuasion? 
I mean, I know there's like railroad operatives. So who's that? Who was that one female uh, operative? I mean, not Desdemona. Um, uh, the synth girl. Um, Glory. Glory. Uh, speak covertly. Let's say I am. Of course. You've just joined, haven't you? All you need to know is this is the first stop for all our new packages. So maintaining proper security here and preventing any unnecessary delays is crucial. Okay. Uh, delays are bad. No one likes delays. It's bad for business. My current package has been in my possession far too long. I'm supposed to deliver the package to someplace nearby, but raiders have complicated matters. So, if you could... Uh, so I'm just muscle. Why not change delivery? If it's such a problem, why not just change the delivery site? The rendezvous site has worked for flawlessly many times. Introducing variables is always dangerous. So clearing <clears throat> out the raiders is overall safer than risking our package being intercepted by our competitors. We're supposed to make okay. a delivery at night. So once you clear out the undesirables, we'll meet after the sun sets. Really? I just got the... Why is everything got to be at night? Bunker Hill is like a home away from home. Only Excuse place Kara Van Tolk have to mingle down? together, you know? I'll buy anything you don't need and sell everything you do. Uh, oh, job? You have any paying work? Yeah. I have something. It ain't easy, though. Caravan has just loves swapping tall tales. But I've heard one story enough times, there's got to be some truth to it. Apparently, the Northern Road goes straight through an old military training yard that's just crawling with a horde of feral ghouls. And that's cutting into my bottom line. So you take care of that, and maybe I can throw a few caps your way. All right. Uh, how many, how many ghouls? How many ghouls be talking about? Who knows? The number keeps growing the more drinks the caravan hands down at the way station. No matter how many of them there are, they're scaring away caravans and customers alike. All right, I want money. I'm not doing the job for chump change. I'm tired of Mercs blowing this off. Are ferals really that scary? Fine. Call it 175 caps. Um, I don't have my, my charisma gear on, so I'll just go ahead and accept it. Take care of your feral problem. Great. If you want to stock up first, you never know when one of my knickknacks will keep you alive. All right, Excuse me. clear the training hey again, yard. Step right up. A little bit of everything from all over. Let's go ahead and Let's barter see and have. see what she You'll has. something you like. Everyone does. All right. Uh, let's see. Wastelander's friend. 50% more limb damage. Of course, my... Uh, my deliverer is like better than that. Uh, ooh, ops, ch black ops chest piece plus one strength and endurance. Right shin guard increases. Ooh, and that's better than what I've got. That's a right leg. Because my right leg is that destroyer one, right? Yeah, and it does the same thing. Oh, except uh, not the, the the two AP, but that's not bad. Destroyer's left arm. Hmm. And that chest piece. Kind of like the idea of more strength and endurance as opposed to like just uh, a more. Of course, that also increases the the AP. Of course, that's because I made it lightweight. I'm sure I could probably make this lightweight. That's a lot of caps, though. If I were to do both of these, this would be a lot of caps. So what if we do this and this, and then. This, and this is a shin guard, so right leg. That one. Jeez. There 
there's no way I've got enough money to be able to buy all this. <laughs> uh, okay, tell you what, let's just cancel the trade. Welcome back. Looking to trade? What if let's see what you got. See something you like? Buy it. My stock moves fast. Well, this is definitely better. So I'm going to do this and trade my my right leg. And we will go ahead and accept. And let's put on our inventory. All right. And I'll be able to, like, upgrade that later. So, all right. Uh, so, he's saying go secure the air. Oh, well, pff, it's it's in the same area as the, uh, as the caravan anyway. So, looks like it's the right place at the right time anyway. Uh, let's keep looking around here. Um, oh, it's not stealing. All right, so we, that's caravan worker. That's upstairs, caravan worker. Hello. <laughs> okay, nothing exciting. Who are you? Hi, Kay. Excuse me. Huh. I haven't seen you before. If you need a doctor, let's get you examined. Oh, you're a doctor. So you're a doctor? Veterinarian, actually. <laughs> that look. Bones get set the same way whether you got two or four of them. So let's talk about you and what kind of help you need. A veterinarian. You're a veterinarian? I'm an old caravan girl, okay? You learn to take care of the animals, or you don't have a caravan for very long. Then you get ambushed, a couple of friends and family start bleeding out on the floor, and you learn how to patch a few wounds. You learn triage, too. Satisfied? Now let's talk about what you need patched up. Oh, do you hear anything? What's new, Doc? Nothing that would interest you. Okay. Uh, do Catch I have anything? Up, Tell me your symptoms. I actually know. No other complaints. All right. Yeah, right now I'm fine. Um... So it's pretty much the standard prices, it seems like. Uh, okay, I don't want to steal anything. What's up here? Nothing exciting. Uh, oh, uh, oh, not about up here. Okay, just like some sort of just high ground. Uh, okay, that's where I came in. This is interesting, because I saw a workshop back behind there. Does this mean that if I do good things for this place, eventually it's going to, like, be another settlement? Because a settlement with a built-in, like, thing like this would be kind of interesting. I mean, because that is definitely a workshop. This is a workshop, for sure. I'm not allied to this settlement, see? Ha 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 Alright. Let's make our way out. Is that a pit boy? I haven't seen one of those in forever. If I can figure out how to get out. There's some sort of battle going on. You there. Caravan or raider? Oh hi. Uh just me. 
I'm here on my own. Freelance, huh? All right. Come on in, but no gunfire. Market's open. You can do as much trading as you like. Uh, I was just in there for several minutes, but thank you. Are you special? Excuse me. Market's the white building with all the fancy columns. Always someone doing trading there. Okay. I'm not sure what that was all about, but I will just roll with it. Okay, is this a way through? Maybe? Maybe, maybe? And around this way. Yes, maybe, yes, maybe. Oh. Hi. Uh, shoot, is this a... Oh, no, it's not. Okay, let's take a look here. Yes, yes, yes. <coughs> Excuse me. Teddy bear. <laughs> yeah, nothing special. Oh. What did I just hear? <gasps> oh! Death claw. Oh, dear. Okay. Tell you what. Sneak attack! Sneak attack! Oh. Hold still. Hold still. Nice. Hey, you okay? Oh, it's Cricket! Well, you're welcome, Cricket. I'm glad I was able to save you before you died. Hey there. Don't eye the Brahmin if you got any sense. I I won't. Uh let's go through this way. Oh! Oh dear! Okay! Shoot! That was a legendary, and apparently this is where we're going. Hi! How you doing today? Uh, no. Um, let's do one there. And one there. Anybody else? No. And there's a legendary in here somewhere. I, I saw it. Oh, be careful, dog meat. And boom, boom. Well done, dog meat. All right. And a wounding submachine gun targets bleed for 25 points of additional damage. This is actually exceptionally powerful because bleeding stacks and with a submachine gun you point blank this uh, uh, this in somebody's face and they're going to take a lot of damage over time that's kind of impressive actually uh, i don't want to care about that don't care don't care don't care let's just take a look upstairs real quick Appear to be anything special. You hiding anything back here? Nope. And there's some kind of war going on. Jeez. All right. So uh, this is where apparently we need to sit and wait because we, we can just sit and wait for this. Uh, but this is going to be our meeting place right here, guys. Uh, but I think that's going to do it for this particular episode. We have kind of gone over our time, so we're going to go ahead and stop here. Um, and we will just sit on this pew and wait for nighttime. 
Uh, but anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this particular episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. It helps me out so very much. For those of you who are regular viewers of mine, please make sure you're hitting that subscribe button and sharing my videos on your social media. I truly appreciate it when you do. And for those of you who already support me in all the ways that you do, thank you guys so very much. I am grateful to every single one of you. And I hope that I am entertaining you to the, uh, uh, in an, and that you guys continue to, to view me and that you find me... Um, in engaging and funny and interesting even when I have a really bad headache and really like feel like miserable right now <laughs> and as always everyone always remember that anyone can be a mouse that roars but it takes someone special to be a lion that squeaks so embrace your inner lion and squeak on all right dog meat let's sit and wait